Hey guys, UWG Nick here and welcome back to Wolfenstein 2. We are back on Venus. In the last episode we got pretty far in the base but we didn't make it all the way through so we're gonna make another, take another stab at it. My English is bestest. And yeah, let's see. I kind of want to try to sneak in this one. So we can do anything with that. Where is that guy gonna go? The answer to that, my friend, is he's gonna go down. <laughs> Humor. At the expense of somebody's corpse. Kinda like Logan Paul. Was that too on the nose? Maybe it was. I keep up with current events. Um, slow down, does that mean they saw me? Hey, there's a cat in here somewhere. Son of a bitch. Can we snipe the fucker? Well, we can snipe the fucker. There's also a guy walking around in power armor there. I remember him. 33 meters that way. Can I see him from anywhere? That isn't him. I'm pretty sure of that. Oh, come on. Just give me the god. Really? It's not on the cycle? There we go. That's not him. The goddamn captain is safe in some lair somewhere. Alright, what do we do? Oh, shoot. Guns blazing? Guns blazing is an option. It's guns blazing. Clearly. Give me. Oh! Whoa! What are you? There's the dog again. Don't do that. Oh, motherfucker. Fuck! I hate when I get the double guns. There's no quick way of switching back as far as I know. The control bindings don't tell me anything anyways. Fuck this. Sneak up on that guy. Kill him. Why did he go over there now? Or is this just part of his path and we, we were too slow last time? Probably. Ooh, that's nasty. So there's a big ass dog somewhere as well. Right. Last I come for that guy. That guy. I missed. Where are you? And now that fucker. Oh shoot. He didn't die. That's a problem. I'm gonna die. Motherfucker. Twice now? Of course I do have the big gun, but it's super, super, super slow. There has to be an easier way. Doesn't it? I just wish I could see the cat. Where's my silenced gun? Okay, nobody noticed a thing. See me? I don't think you saw me. That would have raised the alarm. <sighs> this is scary now. Oh, there he is. There's a dog. The captain is next to the dog, we think. didn't work at all. He just went running. Oh, this is it. 
Fuck! Come on. Seriously, guys. Oh, well, we have a we have a method now. Silencing gun. Shoot our way to the captain. Kill it. Then blow the goddamn dog up before it can do shit. Well, I don't really know what the dog was doing. Anyways, seemed to be bugged out. As far as I'm concerned. That's them, them dead. A big Mr. Whoopi is standing right next to me, I think. Yeah, quick. Quick shift on Q. There you go, he's leaving me alone. Turn back time. At least turn back. Couldn't nail that guy from here, but I think it would alert everybody. Oh shit. Oh fucking hell. That dog was not in the place it was last time. Jesus Christ! Fuck off! Oh my god. This is a terrible time for everybody involved. He died. Who is shooting where? The goddamn captain survived. On 40 armor. Is he shooting from over there? I hope he is. Oh, come on. There we go. Come next to the bomb. Or don't. Shotgun, let's do it. Runner. Now Dan Captain's still alive. Not anymore. Alright. We're in a good position, I think. Finally got through that piece of shit place. Oh lord. Alright. Still somebody here. Lots of somebody's. Fuck you. Somehow get to that main terminal and bring home the Odin codes for the House Merzer mission. Fucking god, it really fucked me over in this one. I think he bugged out the first time we went sneaking because <laughs> it was staring into a corner until I touched it and then it went like, bah! <laughs> Oh, that was funny. Oh, where's my big gun? Because I want that. Yeah, that's the one. I want this gun. It just wasn't the perfect one. It was the great weapon in this situation where there was a lot of close quarters fighting with quick, quick uh, enemies. Unavailable. Right. We're probably going through the one door with a glass window. No, we're not doing that either. I'm stupid. Are we pushing buttons? I thought he said something about getting somewhere. Here? Is this also? So no go. All right, we're missing something. All right, guys, I know where to go, and it was a bit lame, and I'm really upset that I didn't uh, think about it. But you can go in through that little like, ball hole, whatever you want to call it. I think you can do this without the suit, the strangulation thing suit, the chest crusher. Mm hmm. 
Odd encodes. And there we go. Really punch cards? Punch cards? <laughs> the Nazis are like super high tech in some things and really fucking low tech in some things. Like what the hell is that? grab it and eat it raw. <laughs> I don't know why I expected that. That's what emergence lights usually mean. Well, now. But I want to grab some food. Alright, screw it, we're going down. Shotgun at the ready. It's really. Oh, motherfucker. This is. If there's one guy in history of mankind that you don't want to surprise or scare in that kind of way, it would be BJ Blazkowicz. Could have fucking killed somebody. Jesus Christ. This is cute, though. Didn't think I'd make it this long. Well, here's to Brother Blaskowitz, toughest motherfucker I ever met. Terrible! That's some hot damn good banana cream pie right Next there. Next made! Next up! Now here's some wicked love. <laughs> oh, the Lord, that's gonna tear a hole in poor old Orton's tummy. <laughs> Boys! <laughs> so... How was Venus? Did you bring me back anything? Well, the uh, souvenir shop was closed, but I brought you this. Holy shit, Blaskowitz. Well, I absolutely must tell you about the silver fish. It's definitely the truth. It's a very small fish. Seagram! Yes, Paul Quicks! Listen, I'm gonna need your Nazi eyeballs on this one. I am not a Nazi! Whatever. Look, I'm trusting you to decrypt the Odin codes so we can disable the defense system and hijack the outskirts. Yes, poor Chris. But please stop calling me a Nazi. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did I hurt your Nazi feelings? Suck it up, princess. You still here? <laughs> you don't need to be a bitch about it, though. She's in the place of power. You don't want to fuck around with that. Brothers and Ex Nazi sister. Thank sister. You very much. Tomorrow we are going to shoot Nazis until we run out of bullets. But tonight, tonight is for Black Squids.
Come on, give him a punch! Mentos! Mentos! A schmear! Give him a schmear! Get the fuck off me, lass! Should I go get the fuck off me? Hey! I'm a bloody weak commander! That guy's hand is surgically attached, though. And on occasion, we've done barley, but I think, well, I like rye, but he usually does corn. And then we do. <coughs> okay. That was a very odd scene. Wake up, man. No fire duty. Man, where's your arm? Chris, what's going on? Our pilot is still drunk and we're supposed to be in the air by now. Can he fly in this condition? Well, he sure can't fucking fly with one arm. Wait, okay, wait. Horton, Anya, get was him Anya some drinking? coffee or something to sober him up. And Blaskowitz, fly Fergus's fucking arm before this whole operation turns into a shit show. God is that going to be a playable thing? Finding Horton, uh, Fergus' arm? Oh, Fergus. come the fuck on, hey. really? Hey. Fergus, it's Anya. We're looking hey. for an arm. Come on. Oh. Come on. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, what is this? When a man's gonna teach totally drunk and disorderly, there's only one cure. What's that? Oh, Lord, patent it. Hangover, blaster. She doesn't swallow his own tongue. No. What's in it? Well, let me see, a uh, tablespoon of ketchup, mm, orange juice, half a tin of anchovies, two raw eggs, chili pepper, uh, two teaspoons, a dough chicken stock, if you got it, a uh, cough syrup, and a, about a cup of fine whiskey. I think it's the whiskey that does the trick in that case. Damn it, Fergus. Why, you always gotta be losing your arm. We need to find a fucking arm? Are you kidding me? I have Blaskovich. I know not where this arm is you seek. No, oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck is this? What are you? Combat simulations. Freedom Chronicles. What is this? Oh, interesting. No idea what all this is, but Soldat Anfield's letter. Mother told me you got stationed in, at the Ausmerza. What an honor to Sir General Engel and Quartermaster of all things. Don't, don't really know who you buttered up to get the assignment, but take this seriously, please. No more incidents like last time. I will always look to you as after my little brother, but I can't bail you out every time you fumble. Mother's so proud that both her sons are fighting the good fight against terror, keeping our Reich safe. The kid says hi as well, asking when they can see their uncle Alby again. Send me a message when you know when you're back in the fatherland. What are these things? Oh, shit. Heil Hitler. What are these things? May I remind you that I was given command over this ship by the Fia himself. I'm the hunter of terrorists. I'm the one who will bring our biggest enemy to justice. I have the final say when it comes to every last little detail on this ship. You will all submit to my will. I don't know how this place was run before I took over, but it all changes now. Last night during my inspection round, I noticed several annoying irregularities. Cargo not stop strapped down correctly, fuel hose is not inserted correct correctly into the fuel pump station, dripping flammable fluids onto the deck, trash lying on the floor for everyone to see like you were degenerate homeless people. You are not. You are warriors of the greater Rex. Have some dignity for God's sake, Engel. Blitzmensch in real life. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, 
You can pause to read those. Um, there were too many. I'm not going to spend all that time on them. Oh my god, there's a lot. Is this like where they place all the notes I haven't found? Arm, 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 arm. Now listen to this, B. We managed to intercept a transmission detailing all of the construction material they shipped over to planet Venus. Get this. On the list is a fully functional battle walker. They gotta be using it for painting ceilings or some shit. I mean, who the fuck knows? Anyway, you should check out the brief on the war map. Good luck out there, B. Okay, Max. Come. You and me, we'll play some footy. Big sauce. Max, no sad face today. Come. Let's play. Big sauce. Do you not think I see it? Any luck finding Fergus's arm? You. Ask around. Take the easy you way know. out. Do you not think I've been there too? To see my friends murdered in front of me. Dude, the guy is missing half his head. My children? Fergus is on. Man, yeah, didn't I hear Paris Jack mention something about him? Go talk to Paris. Who the fuck is oh, Paris Jack? Ferguson. Hey, Blast Boys. Club Chrysal. You can see my professor. Hello. Because it reminds me of them. Because the pictures come back. Uh, Club cries out. Professor. Oh, Professor. There you are. Oh, Shimshin. Uh, Paris Jack told me there was a problem with Fergus's arm. I, I had no chance to talk to Fergus about it yet. Uh. All right, where's Paris Jack? Alright guys, uh, apparently Paris Jack, the one that's been mentioned a lot, is in the cantina. So let's head over to that. I think it's on this level, like right here. No, it's probably one step down. Bonjour, chef. Any luck with your search? No. I'm gonna contribute, I'm afraid. I'm gonna sneeze in a second. What am I getting? Star card? Can't this guy make toys for Max? Are you Paris? When I speak to Fergus at party, both arms were attached to shoulders. Hey, terrible. Paris hey, Jack, here we go. So, I'm looking for Fergus's arm. You seen that thing? You know, I did see Fergus late last night. See the loss over there? Christ, man, don't look. I was meaning to give her this rose, and uh, I wanted to say something romantic here, uh, romantic, right? Oh, no, on occasion. <laughs> right? Nothing sleazy. Uh, she's a good lass, and I want her to know I'm an honorable man. So, how's this? Maria. Ever since I saw you, I've been wanting to do this. And then I hunted the rose and I say, this rose is a symbol of my good intention. I hope you'll consider going out with me. The lady. Is honest and from the heart, it's all that matters. Yeah, I'm nervous. I don't want to fuck this up. Let me play some to set the mood. So you 
saw him storm off toward the hangar. Mm-hmm. Don't think I've ever seen a man that angry. <coughs> Towards the hangar, eh? Billy. Somebody got some information. Look for the arm in the hangar. That's what we're doing. You alright? We just came from the hangar though, but we'll go look. Pick up potatoes. Potatoes are always handy. You never know when you're gonna need them. Just ask the Irish. Hey! Again, one of those jokes. My friend. I'm gonna get sued for something. Where am I? Jesus. Oh my god, I'm running in circles. Get me the fuck out of here. Alright. There we Fergus go. This was last seen heading for the hangar field depot. Maybe he left his arm there. Right. Well, uh, what did I see? Did I see something? No, it was just a... Wait. I can see the goddamn arm. How do I get to it? Okay, arm. Where are you hiding? Um... Laser weapon. Gibby. Blast. Blast. There we go. Got the arm. Where are we? The fuck are okay. Right. This is a good hiding place for Nazis as well. Oh, of course. I've seen the arm of Fergus, brother. I was too busy drinking. Drinking. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. How's it going? Go good. Oh wait, they were in here, weren't they? You found it? Huh. Get it back to Bob Criso. Okay. I was that's what I was heading, but then I heard them and I was like, oh, alright, yeah, they're near near. But they weren't. They tricked me. Bob cries off. I wanna see this. Anything? No, he's still out. Well, let's attach the arm and see what happens. Did you train to fucking kill me? And there you go. Old Horton's patented hangover blaster always delivers. Boom. What are you lot loitering around for, huh? Haven't we got a mission briefing to attend? Over well, he woke up in a great move, mood. Sorry for uh, going off on you about my shell the other day. You're a good lad. Makes us. My brothers and sisters. My brothers and sisters. Check this out. In less than six hours, Frau Engel is going to make a scheduled appearance on the Jimmy Carver show, live from Hollywood, California. Hey! The bitch is getting her ass kissed on national television. We're going to infiltrate the Ausmercer, disable the Odin defense system, and hijack her ship. And then we find that bitch, and we take her out. What you got? Frau Grace, I decrypted the Odin codes Hep Leskovich brought back from Venus. Turns out, it's just one simple word. Valhalla. Type in Valhalla in any of the Odin terminals, and you will have permission to shut down the automated defense systems. Well, all right. Now, fuck off, Nazi. Like I was saying, we are going to find that bitch, and we are going to take her Grace. out. What? Yes. Good. You Good. do not have the right to label me as something I am not, as someone less than yourself, as someone less than human. Oh, there's some subtext in this. I am not a Nazi. 
There's some subtext here, guys. Okay, I get it. You're not a Nazi. It's you. I'm in love with you. Don't you understand that you dumb idiot? It hurts. It hurts that you are so stupid you don't love me back. But I will dry the tears from my eyes. Get over it and move on. Because I don't need you to be happy. I will just be mentally using your body from time to time for my own personal pleasure. And there's nothing you can All do right. about that, Sigrun. But I'm leaving, okay? No way. Don't be silly. Oh. You coming with us? <laughs> There's some subtext to that whole uh, spiel that Sigrid just blasted at Grace. All right, Sig. You're the expert here. Lay it out for us. We have to approach fast and low. That will buy us time before we are detected by Odin's radar. Once we are directly below the Outsmerzer, we must ascend rapidly and vertically. This will give us the greatest chance of surviving Odin's opening salvo. If we are lucky, we make it back out before Odin has a missile lock on us. Oh, that is some fancy ass flying. What is Anya doing here, by the way? Run! Well, I'm trying. Whoa, oh, 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 you mean that kind of running? Good start. Again, what the fuck is Anya doing here? My girlfriend is pregnant right now. I would not put her in this situation. Well, can can somebody explain the beginning of this to me? I ran, I jumped, I did everything. Run! I'm, okay, I'm gonna stay with you and see what happens. All done, William. Ooh, I switched weapon with a charge on and I still charged. Look the rest. Oh my god. Well, I think we're gonna first waste a bullet and then maybe sneak. I think sneaking's out of the question. I think, I'm not sure. Let's try. Oh. That's a dude. On the dude moved even. I'm not sure that there was a way to do this peacefully. Let's put it. Let's say quietly. Fuck off you. Are these fuckers? No. He took the legs off. Of you, right? There are three different Odin control centers on the Ausmerzer. Two of them controlling the automated defense system. The Hugen control center for the port defenses. The Munin control center for the starboard defenses. Finally, there's the Odin main control center for the ship itself. There's a terminal concealed in the floor in the center of the room, which will open the door leading to the Hugen control center. The other parts of the ship are harder to access from your location. Bring up the ship schematics in the terminal and see if there's a way to reach them, Anya. Hugen and Moonen, uh, Hugen and Moon, oh, Moonen, as uh, she said, were Odin's ravens, I believe.
Odin was the All Father. He was like the highest god of the Asagud or the Asa gods. And uh, yeah, he had two ravens on his shoulders that were his helpers, I guess. Okay, did you, you open something? Go through that door and find the Hogan Control Center. We'll do it. Just calm down. Don't rush me, woman. This is a sensitive operation. Oh, that's one of those guys. Rocket Man. Come on. I need something better for that. Like a shotgun. There's a slight delay when you're shooting with this, which is a little bit frustrating. Um, oh, I'm doing okay. Wah! Going through. Going up. Getting health and armor. And all kinds of deliciousness. Where did we go? Is this a place I wanna go? Let's check it out. Not much here. Did you trap me, you Nazi bastards? Curse your... Whoa, okay. That's three guys dead. Did I get my axe back from you? Four axes. What happens if I turn this on? Ausbetrieb. What does that mean? Ausbetrieb? I can't use it, so it doesn't really matter, no, does it? I just kind of went with this. I have no idea where I'm going. That's an axe. Oh, I'm maxed out. One hand grenade. Maxed out. Dead dude. Maxed out. Uh, so I supposed to get something here? Oh. Can I do this without getting caught? I doubt it. They're shooting, but the captain's not reacting. That is interesting. Can I see the captain anywhere? Why? Oh, that's bad. Ooh, we don't. We don't want to be there. We've been here before. I remember this place. Oh, I killed him by accident. How great. Anybody else left? Oh, that killed him. <laughs> uh, we were here. Like in the first episode, I think. This is where you find out about the uh, Odin control system. What, how are we doing on time? We're pretty good on time. Um, are we going up? Can we go up? One thing I haven't done is killed anybody with uh, the stomp. 
I can't anymore either, so. Can't stomp. Locked. Okay. Is there anything we can need to find here? All right. So up. <laughs> Could it be the big diamond C thing? Impossible. E A L H A L L A. Okay. Well done, William. The port defense systems are offline. Get back here as soon as possible. I think I found a way to reach our other objectives. I was gonna say they probably noticed me shutting off their defensive systems. They did. That's two captains. That is annoying. That isn't a captain. Can I kill him with my pistol without anybody noticing? Probably. Can I see the captains anywhere? I kinda hope I can. See a charge station, that is good. We fought our way through this before. Getting that sweet, sweet electricity. He's up there. I'm gonna go get him. I don't want him sounding the alarm in my back. And I don't, don't dare run in case you're wondering why I'm crawling around slowly. Fucking hell. Fuck! down. Like, not that kind of down, but the other kind of down. Oh, my shotgun. Oh, dear. We're going down again. Not what I wanted. Oh, shit. What? Did I thread the needle on that or what? Fuck! <sighs> Alright guys, I've died here like six times now. And I have a pretty good layout of how it should be done. But I keep getting caught. Fuck, I don't have a good layout. I thought I had a good layout. Oh shit. Now we're getting the fuck out. It's our little cave, this easy place to protect ourselves. Also a very big gun here. He's dead. Some more of those guys. More can the beat. I think we cleared it. Yep. I think we cleared it. Well, 
that worked pretty well in the end. Not as smoothly as I would have hoped, but we didn't get the alarms called on us. We have health and we have armor. Let's get moving with this goddamn level. It's probably like, if I check the journals, there's probably some secrets here. No? Okay, good. We're supposed to go up here and then under here. William, I need some help here. Hurry, please. Now I don't know what's going on. But the last part I had played like eight times now. Another one of these? Or did I just get back to the same place I just came from? Have I been here? I, this feels like I've been here. Um, somebody? What? What's going on? What the fuck? Okay. Uh. Where did I end up and how? Okay, I'm, oh my god. Let's never do that again. I think I think we're pretty low on yeah we got 40 electricity oh would have been a great place to sneak as well too late now Back at where you were, Anya. Yeah. William, well, where is in here? The transport pod. They're on the other side. I've reprogrammed these to take us to the upper parts of the ship. We can reach the other Odin control centers from up there. All right. Do I come in with you or up there? Okay. <sighs> Hold on. We're actually going to end the episode once again in the middle of a mission. Because I'm looking at the clock and I realize I'm running out of time. We love you too, Anya. Oh, there we go. That's a bad thing. That's a bad time all around. He's on top of you. Yeah, he is. Well, he was. So, do you have suggestions? Oh, okay. E. William, I'm up here. Yeah, I can see it. William, there's another shaft on the other side. You should be able to reach the Munin control center from there. I need you to go there and shut down the starboard defense system. I'll keep making my way to the Odin main control center. Where's the captain? Can I cap him from here? I kind of want to throw an axe at that thing. No! Well, that was close. How many axes? Three. Lost one. Who's seeing me now? Alright.
There was a stair staircase going up, wasn't there? There's those two, but I think there was behind there as well. Let's go up that one instead. Because seriously, the name of the game here seems to be Don't Fucking Get Caught. Maybe we're not going up. Maybe we're going this way. Hmm. Through? Through. Sneak? No sneak. Give me all the stuff. Die Neue Wahrheit. Elite Hans comes to life in new adventure books. That's amazing. shut down. You can go back out to the troop deployment hall and climb up the robotic deployment arm. I'm outside great. the Odin main control center. That's Lots less of great. In this place. Get here as fast as you can. Oh, through the legs. Threaded that needle. Shit. This delay in this weapon is killing me though. But it would be too OP if it fired immediately. Like the charge attack is really good, but... Oh, fuck. Oh, Lord. Am I, am I gonna die here? Oh, no! Give me a fucking weapon that works. What? <laughs> I'm so toast. I am so boned. Alright guys, we're gonna end the episode here. So the next episode is gonna start with a freaking bang. But we got we got both Hugin and Munin disabled and the next step is going to hijack the Ausmarsa, I think. But that will all be in the future because for now we're gonna say bye bye.